Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join together this man and this woman, Morgan Elizabeth Jones and James Alfred Ogle, in holy matrimony. which is an honorable estate instituted of God and signifying unto us the mystical union that exists between Christ and His church, which holy estate Christ adorned and beautified with His presence in Cana of Galilee. It is therefore not to be entered into unadvisedly, but reverently, discreetly, and in the fear of God. I pick you for the rest of my life. Into this holy estate, these two persons come now. <laughs> if the solemn vows you are about to make are kept faithfully, and if steadfastly you endeavor to do the will of your heavenly Father, your life will be full of joy, and the home you are establishing will abide in peace. No other ties are more tender, no other vows more sacred than those you now assume. <laughs> oh, you look beautiful. Who presents this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I. He's the heart and soul of our family. <laughs> so Jim, I ask you, will you take this woman to be your wedded wife to live together in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health and forsaking all others? Keep only to her so long as you both shall live. Love it. <laughs> I will. And Morgan, will you have this man to be your wedded husband? to live together in the holy estate of matrimony. Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him, in sickness and in health and forsaking all others, keep only to him so long as you both shall live. Amen. I, Jim, take you, Morgan. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife? <laughs> I'm good now, I'm good now, sorry, sorry. I, Morgan, take you, Jim, to be my wedded husband, to have and to hold. To have and hold from this day forward, for better and for worse. For richer, for poor. For richer or poor. For in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish. To death do us part. Till death us do part. <laughs> Those whom God hath joined together, let no one put asunder. Amen. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> It is my pleasure at this time to present to you Mr. and Mrs. James Ogle. 